And we are going to be exposing somebody. And I think you read the title. We are going to be exposing rice gum. Now, I'm sure you guys know rice gum. I mean, gum. Whoops, sorry. Huh. Don't know where that came from there. <laughs> so, the whole drama with rice gum and then and the odd ones out. Where basically the odd ones out just drew a cartoon about rice gum. And he thought it was a big deal to overreact about something completely stupid that he had no business doing because I'm like if someone makes a video about you and it's a, a big deal talk to the person you claim yourself if you're a, you've said in a bunch of other videos before if you're a real man you'll come up and talk to me yet I just don't know what this idiot anymore like what like what what and so we're going to be dissecting his video to the odd ones out and expose a couple of lies and a lot of maneuver things just to make himself look better and him not as bad and the odd ones out as a terrible person and blah 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 blah. So let's do that now. So at the beginning of the video, he says this. I don't need to be roasting people no more. Don't worry. Yeah, he says he doesn't need to be roasting people anymore. Yet, if you remember correctly, not that long ago, he made a video calling out Bad Baby, where he made a video like saying, uh, what was it again? I don't watch his videos that often because I don't want to give that motherfucker views. What was it? Um, could have had a spot in the clout house, but you just had to run your mouth. I don't know. I'll put I'll put it in right here. Dude, you're me, we just laugh at you. I ain't even really mad at you. Honestly, I feel bad for you. All you ever do is chase the clout. Too bad you had to run your mouth. Could have been in the fucking gang. Could have lived in the fucking house. She a troll. She is not for real. Let so right there, there's a lie already. We're not even 15 seconds into the freaking video yet. And he's already lied. Even if it's not about this topic, it still involves the video and him lying. So, not even 15 seconds and he's already, and he's already lied. So, what else is he lied about? Pr probably everything, but let, let's get let's keep going. Now, the next thing he does, I didn't catch till the second time I watched the video when I had to um cover all of it into what I would until what I was going to into what I was going to say. And he pops out a pop tag that says irrelevant. When he said, like I showed you before, he doesn't have to roast people or say mean things about him anymore. Even though you're not saying that out of your mouth, you still put that in your edit. So, there's that. Roll it. But this YouTuber is talking bad, talking dirty about me. I don't even know who this guy is. They started tagging him. His name is like Thaws One. So there you go. Calling people irrelevant again. When you said that you weren't going to call out people anymore. So you wrote, so you made a song about Bad Hat Baby. And then you are uh, put up the pop tag of him being irrelevant. So again, how far are we into the video? I don't even know. Like, I don't even know how far we are into the video. Because um, I'm doing this and I'm not watching it because my computer and iPad are on my bed. So, I don't even know how far we're into the video, but we are not even a minute, I believe, into, we're, yeah, we're not even a minute into the video yet. And he's already told two lies. And we haven't even gotten onto the topic of it yet. How many lies has he told in this video? So far, two. And the video's like seven minutes long. Let's just go to the next part before I just have a freaking scream attack. So then he brings up when the odd ones out called him out before about some stupid stuff. But before that even happens, before he even gets to that, he starts to put up the video and he edits something out that um maybe needed to stay in, but put it out to make himself look better. Roll it. Hey, I have over a million subs on YouTube. Okay, random pause, but like, why would you bring up your subscriber count to random people? Like, I'm a YouTuber, and if I'm around random people, the last thing I want to tell them is my subscriber count. But if you watch the full video, he edits a piece out of what he said. Roll that clip. 
bring up, hey, I have over a million subs on YouTube. But that's tacky. You don't just start conversations like that. So, see? Rice Gum left that out when he was editing the video to make James, like, look like a douchebag and he was flexing and whatever, but, like, it doesn't matter. That had nothing to do with you in the first place. And second off, what's even the second off? You just, you didn't even have to do that. You need to get to your point. So we would, so we would keep watching. By now I probably would have clicked off like, nope, this is a waste of my time. So then after him, blah, 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 and for like a couple, for like a, like a minute or something, I don't freaking even know at this point. He gets to the rice gum part of when he went up to another group of kids and he said rice gum. And this is how he reacted. Group of kids and I said, so do you guys watch any YouTube videos? And most of the kids did the same thing, looking at me like I was weird. But one kid said, rice gum. Ah, ew. Okay, what? Some kid just said rice gum, my name, and this man just said ew. As if it's like gross or something. Why did this man just say ew like that? Like, he already doesn't like me. This video was posted over a year ago. He obviously doesn't like me already. I haven't done anything to this guy. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Like, like... Why are you overreacting? So he said, ew, that's his personal opinion of you. So basically you're saying that we're not allowed to have personal opinions of you? You, I call you rice dumb because you freaking have like the IQ of like a potato. You're gonna call me after saying, oh, she, oh, she called, she says I have the IQ of a potato. Like, what the heck? Like, blah, 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 blah. Like, just shut up. That was not a big deal. All he said was, uh, ew, rice gum. He just doesn't like you. You don't have to be like, oh my God about it. So... That part's on you right there. So that drama that happened before where he said, I gave him a freaking warning. I don't want to like go down this road. Probably because there was no ammo there in the first place. All he said was, uh, ew. That's all he said about you was just, uh, ew. So there was nothing even there in the first place. That was just him trying to spark up drama because at this time and point, because at that time and point, he want he wanted fame, he wanted all that stuff. I don't even know how he got it in the freaking first place. And oh my god, ay 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 ay. Rice dumb, you are a complete idiot. So, now that's part's over. Let's get on to the part about this now drama with um, the Owens Out's new video. So he starts the video and he starts watching blah, blah, blah and stuff. And then anytime I notice through the video, anytime that something that that brings up Rice Dumb in in the I Ones Out's videos, he will go, whoa, whoa, wait, pause for a second, and puts like build up music in it to be like, whoa, whoa, hang on a second, stop here. We gotta talk about this, oh my God. Like, that is not needed, and why that music? Like, you don't, you don't need that. Just say, oh, yeah, he, he, he did that, like, blah, blah, blah. Like, it doesn't matter. But, of course, he needs to get all the attention, and he wants all the views and all the people. He's even said it himself in another video. But he just, like, just built it up. That's just how he is. But I, I just don't know at this point. So you're telling me this man is two feet from his friend, but he's going to call him up. And then he proceeds to say that Brian just bought a brand new watch. I don't know if you guys know this. I know my name is Rice, but my real life actual name is Brian. And I just feel like as a writer and as like a cartoon, you know, maker, whatever, out of all the names you could have picked, you picked Brian. That's my name. It's like I'm starting to think he's talking about me. I mean, out of all the names you could have chosen, Kevin, Nicholas, Jimmy, I don't, I don't know, why Brian? Like, I'm pretty sure this guy is talking about me, but I mean, I guess it's too quick to assume. Like, I don't want to look stupid in that. And Rice, dumb. Don't worry, it's too late. You've already looked, you already look stupid. So, you don't have to worry about uh, looking stupid because you've, you've already done that since the beginning of this video. Since your beginning of your career, you've looked stupid. So, you don't have to worry about that. So we get a little bit further into the video, and then it comes up with the whole odd ones out saying that you shouldn't spend that much money on clothes or, or I'm blah, blah, blah. And then, if you remember correctly, in an older video, Rice said, you know what, I'm gonna stop flexing all, on all y'all. Like, all my songs and a lot of my videos of me flexing, like, oh, look at all the stuff I have and blah, blah, blah. If you remember in a couple of diss tracks, like, 
I think it was I Dubs just track. He said, "What? Like I sleep in a mansion and like I like I look at all the money I have and blah 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 blah." He talks all about that stuff. But in this video, he's flexing by saying, "I have money to waste." Like you don't because like he didn't say this part. Like I know you're a small channel and blah blah blah. But I just have money to waste. You don't because you're poor, but I just have it to waste because I'm like, I'm making bank here. He didn't say that part, but he said he said he said the he said the other part. Just roll it. Spending that much money on a white t-shirt with an iron-on logo. There's no material in that shirt that makes it as expensive as it is. Now you know what? I can't have to agree with this guy on that, man. A white shirt with a red rectangle, that is a complete waste of money. I'm going to be honest. Like, if you're spending money on that, you're kind of stupid. Like, it is a waste of money. The thing is, though, where I'm coming from, like, I just have money to waste. Man, wait, what did you say, Rice? Coming from, like, I just have money to waste. Yeah, he admits it himself. He says, oh, I have money to waste. That's flexing. So you're going against the words that you said a long time ago. And what did you say at the beginning of the video? You're about positivity and blah, blah, blah. You're going against your own freaking words. That's how stupid you are. Do you not watch when you edit? Like when people edit their videos, they rewatch it a couple of times. Like, okay, that's right. That's right. Oh, that's wrong. Need to fix that. Do you not watch your edits before you freaking post a video? You're going against your own words and you're going against what you say you believe in now. So there's another strike right there. So I don't even know if I can take this. I don't even know if I can take this anymore, but you guys wanted this, so you guys better enjoy this. Wait a second. And, and further into the video, he says, don't, I don't think that I'm above everyone else. Like, don't, like, don't, like, just because of clothes. Now, this part doesn't have to deal with the clothing, but him saying that he doesn't think that he, don't think that I'm above everyone else because of the clothes I wear. Like, I'd never, like, he's putting words on my mouth. Like, I never said that I'm above anyone else. You, yeah, no one else said it. You said it yourself. I did, he said that he's never said it in a video or anything like that. Like, I'm not worried about the clothes thing right there. Right there is the, the clothes thing. That's not what I'm talking about. What I'm talking about is when he said, I, I've never said this. He's put a, he's put a freaking words in my mouth. I never said that I'm above everyone else. I just did a little digging with my with my researcher and I'm part of my I'm part of my YouTube team like like that stuff like my like my like my, my editor and blah, blah blah like all that stuff and we found that he posted a music video where he's said it himself roll it so there he's basically saying that he that who like a lot of youtubers can't like catch up to his to his views and his subscribers that's bragging that you're above everyone else like you said so don't put something on youtube if you don't think that it's gonna come back to bite you in the butt because that just did and that was like a and that was a year ago that video was a year ago and that video just came back to bite you in the butt right there so guess you learned a lesson there or no, but because you have the IQ of potato. I, for, I forgot rice dumb. You're, you're stupid. That's why we call you rice dumb here. Boy, it's getting hot in here. I mean, to turn on my fan. It's either it's either it's getting hot in here or it's all the tea I'm spilling on spilling on rice gums. Let me turn on the fan. Freaking, it's getting it's getting hot in here. I don't even know if I don't know if it's the tea I'm spilling or it's just hot in here. I think it's probably the tea. So let's keep spilling. Then he said a little bit a little bit closer to the end of the video saying how like what the hell like what the hell like i know for now i know for a fact he's calling me out like like what what the heck why can't you just put your name put my name in the title and like what and like um put like what is it okay like, put my name in the title or at least say my name or like whatever why don't you have to like sneak it in there here's a little thing rice because he's not like you he's nothing like you roll it this guy has to talk about me. I knew he was talking about me, but I could not assume. I did not want to jump to conclusions, but now I know for a fact this dude was talking shit about me the whole video. What the hell? Why can't this guy just roast me publicly or put me in the title or like tweet at me or something? This guy had to literally just be low key and sneak diss me. What a pussy. You know Probably also another reason why he didn't he didn't put your name in is because he doesn't need your name to get views like you say everyone does. Like you say, I'm put like I'm putting your name in the title right now. You're probably thinking, oh, she's only doing it just so she can get views. Cause look at her subscribers, look at her views. She's not relevant. Like I'm getting attention. 
I don't need you for that. And another thing, he is a big YouTuber. Yes, you have like 9 million, I think, and he has like 6 million. He's getting close to you, but he's more he's more relevant than you. And he, he, like, if I ask people, like, who would you rather watch? The odd ones out or, or, rice, or rice dumb? People will say the odd ones out because he doesn't need your name in the video to get attention. He gets that enough. You need to put other YouTubers in your in your titles to get yourself attention. That's why you made all those videos roast roasting kids. Like, use common sense, boy. I don't even know if I can finish this. I think there's like like two minutes left. I don't even think I can do the last two minutes because like I hate this, but I'm doing it for you guys. So I guess let's do like the. I think there's like two more things left I have to talk about. Let's just roll it before before I freaking I freaking just go out. Best part. Here's the last thing of the video. Best part. So he doesn't know what he looks like because of, he's an he's an animator. He decides to look up a vlog, and there's lots of videos on his own channel of him revealing his face to see what he looks like. But he had to search up this one vlog that had something in it to put in the video to use against him. Like you could have used his Q and A video or him react or reacting to the the teens reacting. You could have gotten those. Those would be simple. Those are already there. You didn't have to like search up and waste time. But no, you had to find a video that had something in it. And of course he chooses one that's freaking stupid. So I'll show you the clip and then I'll explain why it's more stupid. <laughs> Yo, so I think he's the one in the white shirt. Okay, he's kind of tall. Yeah. Sunglasses, oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Yes. Sunglasses. Oh, it finally happened, the moment. <laughs> okay, so there you saw the clip. It's It seems harmless, right? I mean, like, he's just hugging him. Then he takes a picture with him. But, no, Rice has to um, make something stupid out of it. Roll it. Oh, man. <laughs> why did he hug him again, though? Like, why did he have to hug him again? Is it? It's just kind of awkward, you know what I mean? So, look, there he is. He's like, why do you have to hug him again? Here's something for you, Mr. IQ of four. It's called hugging somebody to greet them like, oh, hey, buddy, nice to meet you, or nice to see you again. Then take a picture, because if you played it a little bit longer, you would have noticed that uh, Jane Animations, great YouTuber, by the way, she um, was vlogging, so doing it for his part and then hugging for a picture. So, like, you greet somebody with a hug and then you take a picture with a hug. That, that, that's not a big deal, but, of course, you had to, like, make it look like a big deal. Like, oh, that's kind of awkward. Like, you know that, man? Like, you didn't have to throw that in. That didn't even have to do with it. You could have just said, oh, there's his face kind of tall. Um, looks okay. Like, blah, blah, blah. You didn't have to, like, bring that bring that other part up. Like, but, but you're stupid, so there's that. Okay, I think this is the final thing right here. So... Again, beginning of the video, he said, I'm about that positivity. I don't need to roast people to get views anymore, and blah, blah, blah. Yet, at the end of the video, he says, I'm going to see an stick you to drawn cartoons, and blah, blah, blah. And you have two, and you have like three options, and you have three options here. Number one, diss track. Then two, box and match. Yet, box and match. Sorry. I, I'm freaking screaming, like, blah. So, anyway, <clears throat> excuse me. So he says he's promoting positivity, he's not going to do it anymore. And then before he said, yo, I'm not going to box this kid, blah, 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 blah. But yet you just said that you would do that. Roll it. Drawing cartoons and hugging dudes, all right? Stop roasting me. Don't ever talk about me ever again. Because if you ever just mention my name in a negative way, get three options, all right? Option one, this track. Option two, boxing match. Option three... end of the video for me now so hope you guys enjoyed this if you liked me roasted rice gum and making him ma take a massive l for what he for what he did the massive l that he just took then give me a thumbs up and if you want me to do more stuff like this give a thumbs up so i know and don't forget to subscribe down below and hit the notification bell so you'll get a notification every time i upload a video follow me on my all my social medias they will be down in the description box 
and comment on who you think I should roast next or what or what I should do next because I'm always looking for you guys' opinions because again, even though I have lots of ideas and I have lots of videos that I am planning on doing, I like to think I like to take your guys' ideas too because like this is a collaborative collaborativeness. Like I'm making the content for you guys. What would you enjoy? So if you guys enjoyed, I will see you on the next dose, except for you guys dumb. Bye!